So I made bacon and cheesy scrambled eggs and biscuits, and we're watching Weeds. We both have seen this show, but we're re-watching it. Get it, baby. Get it. Get it. Get it. <laughs> Good girl. I'm making some grilled cheese sandwiches because my mom gave me some of her vegetable tomato based soup. So we're going to have some soup and grilled cheese because it's really cloudy. I don't know if you can see from here, but it's been raining, which I love and it's still been cloudy. And I got my two best friends here, right? Right. We're waiting for something to drop. <laughs> Good girls. So we got another HelloFresh box this week and I just made the sweet chili pork and green bean bowls. And I'll show you what it looks like in a second here. And this is what they look like. Hey guys, I'm about to pull into the driveway. I'm literally gonna vlog here because I know the pups are gonna go crazy. Um, when I get inside and I won't be able to talk to you, but it's just been one of those days, but it's Friday. So everything just gets better when it's a Friday, right? So I'm making another HelloFresh meal today. It's the Italian chicken over lemony spaghetti and it has zucchini in it as well. And here it is. So the Amazon pillows came in, my little covers that I got, but I don't know. I think they look a little cheaply made, so I don't know if I'm going to keep them. I really love like the little messages on them, but... It's kind of just like an print, you know, that was, it looks cheap to me, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. They're cute from far away. See, look, I think they're cute from far away, but when I get up close to them, I can tell that they're inexpensive, <laughs> if that makes sense. So. Let me know what you guys think. And then I also did get a Bath and Body Works package that I'm gonna share with you right now. I just had to take pictures just now of these adorable candles because they are so pretty. And I love the packaging of these hand soaps and I'm not gonna lie, they were on sale, but it definitely was a draw for me to order some when they're this cute. I'm totally gonna use these over and over, like refill them because they're so pretty. Um, okay, so I have four candles. They were $10 off, so I did get them on sale. But these, this one, they're all new, I believe. This one's called Pink Apple Punch, Crisp Apples, Sunkissed Melon, Sugar Crystals. It smells so good. The actual jar is this beautiful color. It's a pink with like a little bit of a hint of like, um, like a tangerine. It's so pretty. Love it. And then the lid itself is like a rose gold copper color. Sorry if my voice sounds deeper. I just woke up. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's definitely a very sweet scent, but I can definitely um, smell the punch kind of notes to it. So there's that one. And another rose gold lid. And this one's called Pineapple Pancakes and had really good reviews online. Look at how cute that little stencil design is. And then this one is more of like a peachy, light peach color. And here are the notes. Fresh pineapple, fluffy pancakes, sweet banana slices, and brown sugar. From smelling it directly, I don't really smell a ton of banana. There's like a little hint of it at the end, but mostly I smell pineapple and pancakes and it smells so good. Adorable. Next we have this really adorable one for Valentine's Day. I mean, are you kidding me? So cute. I love all the detail to that. This one's called Candy Hearts. This is the design on the top. And it's cotton candy sugar, sparkling raspberries, and sprinkle of love from Cupid. It reminds me of a lot of the candy fairy floss, I think it's called, at Christmas time, which Chris and I both love because we kind of like the 
sweeter scent sometimes. So I know we're going to enjoy that one. And last but not least is this beautiful one. It's more of like a purpley pink jar with the same color lid. And that's so pretty. Wild Berry Jam Donut. I have a feeling people are going to go crazy for this one for sure. Oh, I almost forgot to show you the notes again. Sweet Wild Berry Jam Powdered Donut Brown Sugar Crumble. Oh my goodness. Has, you Seriously, it smells like a jam donut for sure. Raspberry jam donut. All right, and then we have the hand, um, foaming hand soaps. This one's called BU, Sweet Sugar Sprinkles. And I just love it. It's not like a, a wrapped design. The bottle itself is actually this really pretty blush pink. I just thought those would be pretty for Valentine's Day time. Even Easter, because I do pinks in Easter. And then we have Pink Petal Tea Cake. Another really pretty pink shades. And then, of course, I had to get this one. Be Positive Strawberry Lemon is the scent. It has a little bee on it. Holly here is um, Chris and Lucy getting up upstairs. Where are you? There you are. Why are you barking? Why are you barking all the time? Hmm? You hear Daddy coming? <laughs> See? Told you guys she got her voice. Is that Daddy? Is that daddy coming? <laughs> Who's that? It's his daddy. Look how long she's getting. She's like three of my hands now. No way, mama. No way, mama. Both of them sunbathing, but also squinching in the sun. And Chris is helping me put together a table, if you can hear him in the background. We had to close the door so that they didn't get to the little nails and everything, but look at these two. Look at these two. Good girls. So Holly just put her nose on the ornament, so that's what that little wet mark is there. Hey, this is your ornament. You can't eat that. She wants to chew everything, but this is her first Christmas ornament. I ordered it off Etsy, and they customize it to your dog's like body type. Yeah, you like it? You really like it? Good girl. So you guys are getting a sneak peek. I still have a few things I'm gonna change up in the room. I'm gonna do a whole like beauty room tour, but this table came in. That's what Chris was putting together for me. It was apparently not very easy. Whoever made this was, yeah, not the best, but he was able to fix it and get it together. Um, pretty much everything that's on here I already had and just kind of had things tucked away and saved. So I will go over each like little detail when I do a room tour for the beauty room. Right, Holly? Good girl, honey. And then I move the other table over here. And so it's like my little workstation. Maybe if I get a, um, what's it called? Desktop computer, it'll be there at some point. And I still have to fix the curtains, so don't look at that. I think I might move how the chair is. Um, maybe angle it a little more instead of having it right in front of the table. That's what that looks like over there, but I'll show you in more detail soon. I also forgot to show you guys that Chris got me these beautiful roses this week. I think it was actually um, last date night, but I didn't show you. And I love them. I love them when it's Valentine's Day even more so, like when I have that decor. Look at how cute. We have a little puppy wonderland back in my car. We're gonna go um, drive up to some snow. Oh, Holly, you want to be with Mama now? Okay. But anyways, she has her bed over here, too. And she's playing with her toys. So they have a little, little spot. And we're going to have a picnic later. So we've got some to do.
we're having a little Del Taco picnic in the back of the car. <laughs> and looking at all the beautiful snow. We got the pups here begging for food, waiting for a scrap or two. Look at them intently staring. But obviously I'm gonna go out and show you in a second, but it's, it's not that cold out considering how much snow is out there. Looking at snow. right now and I just realized that I never said goodbye or really had a close out for the vlog so thank you so much for watching um the vlog is a little shorter this week because Lucy actually had an extraction a tooth extraction this week and to be honest I was a little nervous and stressed about that and but she's doing really good as you could see from the um snow clips she's doing great um she's totally fine but I think that probably slowed me down this week or I'm not really sure but more to come next week.